Hi everyone and welcome back to my channel. I decided to record a new series of VC dial videos. These videos are usually short and they are not basic training. So if you don't know what is VC dial or you want to learn VC dial, please check my VC dial training series. These tips are generally helpful for VC dial supervisors and system admins. Let's get to the first tip by introducing adminer.php. The easiest way you can manage your database in VCDL or I want to say any other Linux system. What is adminer.php? It's a web panel that you can manage your database. You can log in via web, see all your database and tables and view or alter your data. Of course we have multiple panels like this in the internet so what is so special about dbmanage? It's easy to install. You just need to go to the website adminer.org, copy the uh, link of the software, SSH to your VCDL system, go to the web folder that is srvwwhdocs, download adminer.php. I use wget here to download it, rename it. It's easier to refer to that when you rename it from adminer.4.8 or whatever version you have downloaded to adminer.php or to any other name that you want. And final step is to create a database user. So to connect to the database, enter MySQL command, create a user by create user command. We can give it a password. For example, here my username is my user and my password is my password. Of course, don't use that. Give it permission to the asterisk database. You know that the VCDL database name is asterisk. And flush privileges. And that's it, you are good to go. Now you can refer to your VCDL URL s slash adminer.php and log into your database and manage it. Wow, that was fast. So if you want to download the slides, go to my blog, www.omid.blog. If you have any question, you can comment here or ask in my blog. Thank you for watching.